Let's solve some of the questions from Population Studies paper 2021. Now, one of the questions that we focus on is based on life table. A very direct question, what is IX in life table? So, IX in life table is nothing but number of person living at an exact age X. Similarly, there is a concept DX that talks about number of deaths between the exact age X and X plus 1. LX is number of persons who lived between the exact age X and X plus 1. So those are certain indicators that we have in life table and this is just one of those uh, similar many other questions have been asked in the previous papers as well. So a very uh, expected question. The next is from the health section. Which of the following is a carrier of dengue disease? Now the correct answer here is Aedes mosquito, housefly responsible for food poisoning, Culex responsible for uh, West Nile uh, fever or Japanese encephalitis, Anaphilis responsible for malaria. But here the question asks about dengue and the correct answer here is AD. So again a very direct question. The next question is an interesting question. Which of the following indicator could be developed from the census 2011 to establish that females are the head of the household in absence of the male? Now, where would you get this data? So, it is a little applicative question. You need to understand it. Where would you get this data? This data would come from the information on marital status. Right. If there is a female and a male member, but the male member is absent, in that case, the female becomes the uh, head of the household. And this is directly through the marital status. We can identify this answer. So again, a very uh, basic question pertaining to little logic and reasoning. <coughs> the next question is, which of the following falls under perinatal mortality? So first of all, what is neonatal? Neonatal means the death that happens within seven days of birth, right? If we say it is an early fetal death, that means the baby is less than 500 grams or at least 500 grams. If it is a late fetal death, the baby is around 1 kg or 1000 grams. So perinatal means what? Perinatal talks about the early fetal uh, uh, the late fetal sorry and the early neonatal death that means during the late pregnancy or the early childbirth within the first seven days if the death happens that is considered as a perinatal mortality so very very important neonatal perinatal the difference between the two extremely important question and uh, mortality and morbidity are extremely important topics in population you every time have around 10 to 20 questions directly or indirectly asked from this section the next is which of the countries recorded highest deficit of ecological reserves so if we talk about the deficit in united states it was somewhere around minus 4.46 China at minus 2.4, Qatar at minus 9.5 and India at minus 0.71. That means the highest values among these were from Qatar. Now, deficit in ecological reserves are an important indicator of the uh, overall uh, e environmental development and the, the urbanization, the pace of urbanization in those areas. Also, along with that, uh, how well the forest reserves or the ecological reserves are protected is again an indicator. So India do, does a far better than the rest of the countries here. So here the correct answer becomes Qatar. These were some of the questions but as we have seen in population studies a lot of questions came from contemporary section based on 2011 census. So the recent census becomes important, the terminologies in the census become important, finding out the gender gap and the reading of the life tables is again an important concept. Then last two questions were based on comprehension. Those were relatively simpler if you are able to understand the passage and you have a basic understanding about the concepts of population studies you can solve those with utmost um, uh, confidence so those were some of the things that we have discussed the complete paper solution is available in the link below thanks for joining it